hi guys how are you all doing today so today without wasting much of your time let me just go straight to the point today i'll be telling giving us three reasons why you should let him go three reasons why you should let him go number one is when he stopped communicating with you when he stopped communicating with you it is a sign that you should let him go why do i say that if he if you are going out with someone and the person is wants you he all of a sudden he stopped calling he stopped testing he stopped caring caring about you he, he doesn't he just ended the communication he doesn't want to know he doesn't even know what he doesn't even want to know how you are doing what is happening around you no call no test and when you call him he'll tell you that he is busy that is a sign to tell you that you should let him go all right that's a sign that you should let him go when he is not calling you and when you call he will tell you that he is busy what is he telling you that he's no longer interested but you don't expect him to come out and tell you and say oh i'm no longer interested i'm this that, that. no if you are going out with someone the person should know, will, will always want to hear from you when you start seeing those signs just know that it is time for you to let him go all right you know number two is when he start getting violent when you are going out with someone and the person starts raising his hands on you, every little thing you do, before you even finish doing whatever thing you do, he will hit you, he will slap you, and you are still in that relationship. You are still with him because after beating you, he will still come back and apologize. And you feel you, you love him and you feel you are doing the right thing. You are actually wasting your time. Okay, it is not right for you to dwell in a relationship where the person keep hitting you, where the person keep beating you all the time. Some time ago, I went out and I, I, when I went to have, I had, I overheard some ladies discussing, oh, my friend beats me and after beating me, he came to apologize. That's to show that he actually cared about me. That is very wrong. I say, man, you do not have any right to put, lay your hands on, on a woman. And you, a woman that is just in telling your friend that he, he beats you and that's to show that he loves is a lie. Someone who loves you, someone who cares about you will not want to raise his hand on you. If I care about you, I will not want to raise my hand on you. I will not want to be, oh, will I even beat you? And why will someone beat you and you are saying that, oh, he, he, he loves me? Are you all right? Someone abused you, said, say things that he's not supposed to say. Emotional abuse, verbal abuse, and you, are, and you call that a relationship. It is not a relationship. It is time for you to let him go. All right? The last one I'm going to give us today is when he's trying to make you uncomfortable. He is not comfortable with you at all. Both of you are walking on the road. Immediately he sees his friends or his family, he starts walking back. He's not proud of you. He's only comfortable when both of you are together. But when you are with when he is with his friends or with his family, he doesn't even want you to come close. The way he treats you, he doesn't, he's ashamed of you. He is not comfortable with you. Why would you be in such a relationship going out with someone who is not comfortable with you? How can you? He's only comfortable with you when both of you are, are together. Even when you're walking on this on the street, he's not comfortable with you. He's working with you, you see people passing, he's drawing back, and you are laughing and saying, oh, I'm in a relationship. You are not in a relationship. He is not comfortable with you. When people can walk away from you, when people can walk away from you, let them walk. When people can walk away from you, from you let them walk. And when they are walking, please don't forget to give them transport fare. That will ease their journey. So that their journey can be easy. When you give them transport fare, they can, they'll be able to walk fast. Don't be in a relationship where you are, where you are not accepted. Okay? So when you see these signs, these are the signs that you will see. Whenever you see these signs, just know that you should let him go. You can't be in a relationship with someone who is not comfortable with you. He can't even introduce you to his friends. They can't even show you around. 
No, that is not a relationship. Okay? Be with somebody who will come in, who will always want to hear your voice. Be with someone who will not abuse you verbally, emotionally, or any form, or beating you, or whatever. Be with somebody who will not do that. Be with someone who will be comfortable with you. Not someone who is ashamed of you. Okay? So I will be stopping here today. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe and, li and like and share. Don't forget to click on that red bell. That will enable you to know whenever I upload a new video. You take good care of yourself and have a beautiful day. Bye.